How to set up a call chime for someone with very limited movement. The equipment we will be using in this demonstration is all available online and includes a PA1 call chime, a pillow switch, and a simple Radio Shack adapter. Recording. Today I'm going to set up uh, an adapted call chime for someone who can't hit a, a, a doorbell or ring a bell. And it's very important that uh, there's always some sort of call system for a person. This is Ozzy. He uses his Dynavox for a call chime. But sometimes, like when he's in bed, he doesn't have it on. And we're going to set it up today to work with head movement instead of the use of a hand to um, turn the call chime on. This is a switch that's called a pillow switch. And you can get them online. You can search for pillow switch. It's got a little bit of Velcro on the back. And all I did was I put a little bit of um, Velcro on the back of his uh, headrest. And it's held there with a safety pin. The pillow switch comes this way with both of these pieces of Velcro. What I need to do is find a spot for Ozzy where he can stay off the switch when he wants to stay off it, but also his head can push up against it when he wants to activate his switch. So we found a spot behind his head where he can hit the switch when he wants to. And this is a uh, Med Labs portable alarm. I like these because they're reliable. They're not wireless, but they're very reliable. And when, I'm going to cover this a little bit. Can you hit that switch? Perfect. So what we don't want is for him always to be hitting it by accident or for it to be a difficult switch for him to reach. But I think we've got kind of a perfect setup while he's in his wheelchair. And now I have to go set it up um, for his bed too so that when he's in bed he can use head movement to get to the switch. Let me show you one other thing. This portable alarm comes with a quarter inch jack and most of the switches that we use like this pillow switch or a buddy button or a switch you could operate with your foot come with a 1 8 inch jack. So I just bought this at Radio Shack and it's an adapter that has a quarter inch jack going in and it accepts an eighth inch jack and that's all I it was about three dollars at Radio Shack to modify that so and then this you can also get a cord at Radio Shack to get this buzzer far out of the room and you can leave it out in the hallway if you want to so there's an adapted call chime operated by just the movement of head now here's a list of the equipment that you can use to set someone up with very limited movement so they can still operate a call chime.